Christmas milkshakers. Welcome to Jen's Jolly Bakes with me, Jen. Do you fancy baking something jolly tasty? Oh, yes, I was hoping you were going to say that. Let's spin the wooden spoon to see what's inside the mixing bowl. Pastry. Pesto. Peppers. Hmm, I wonder what festive jolly bake we're making. Pastry tartlets. Mm-mm. They look ever so festive, don't they? Look at all the red and green vegetables on top. To make this Christmas jolly bake, you will need a sheet of ready-made puff pastry, or you can make your own, four teaspoons of pesto, some ripe cherry tomatoes, some courgettes, some red peppers, a little bit of olive oil, and some mozzarella. Don't forget to ask a grown-up to help you and make sure you wash your hands with warm soapy water before you begin. And if you have any allergies, make sure you swap out the ingredients to suit you. It's time for a festive jolly bake. Step one. Ask a grown-up to turn on the oven and grease a tray with some butter so that your pastry tartlets don't stick. Step two. Roll out your ready-made puff pastry like this. And then using a child safe knife, you can cut it into squares. So I'm going to draw a line all the way down the middle. And then cut them into squares. You can make them as big or as little as you like. Next, place one of your squares onto your greased tray. And keep going until you've used all the pastry. Make sure you leave a gap in between for the puff pastry to spread out a little bit. Step three. Ask a grown-up to help you chop up all of your yummy vegetables Drizzle some olive oil over them and pop them in a tray into your oven for about 10 minutes. And then you can take some pesto with a spoon and pop it on top of your pastry tartlets. Make sure you leave a gap all the way around the edge so the pastry can puff up nicely. Then pop some vegetables, your roasted vegetables, on top of your pastry tartlets. And you can also take some mozzarella and tear it off into chunks and pop that on top too. And when that's cooked, it'll be all bubbly and gooey. You can use whatever vegetables you like. I just chose red and green because I thought it was festive. When you've done all of your pastry tartlets, a grown-up to pop them in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes. It's time for a Christmas Jolly Taste Test. Wow, look at these. They look like little Christmas parcels. Which one should I choose? I'm going to go for this one. Mmm. Mmm. Tried and tested. That's a jolly good Christmas bake. Why don't you try making these? You could serve them at a festive party. Oh, yeah. Let me know how you get on. Ask the grown-ups to head to the Milkshake website and click on Be On Milkshake. Have a lovely Christmas. I hope it's a delicious one, and I'll see you very soon. Bye.